for me, when people ask me about season two, it's usually they come at me with like, I was some sort of victim to season two. Uh, Do you know what I mean? And I'm always like, no, it's okay. I promise. It's good. Barbie Ferreira is good after she announced that she would not be returning for season three of the Emmy winning series Euphoria. She wrote a heartfelt goodbye to her character Kat on her Instagram story last August, but didn't really explain at that time why she was leaving. But phrasing it as, I'm having to say a very teary-eyed goodbye, made it sound as though it wasn't something she wanted to do. Well today, on the Armchair Expert podcast, Barbie decided to clear up some of the rumors that have continued since her announcement eight months ago. Maybe you walked off set one day. I actually did not walk off set. Okay. Well, Barbie shuts down the report that she had an argument with showrunner Sam Levinson during the filming of season two. She does admit that they weren't seeing eye to eye in terms of character development for Kat. Sam writes for like things that he relates to. I don't think he relates to Kat. I relate to Kat. I really wanted to be able to not be the fat best friend, you know? Uh-huh. I don't want to play yeah. that, and I yeah. think they didn't want that either. The show had 12 main characters and 17 recurring characters in season one. Both those numbers increased in season two. There were 15 main characters in the sophomore season and 19 recurring characters. The show has only done 18 episodes. <laughs> so yeah, there's simply not enough narrative space to properly showcase all those characters. So some have to go without significant storylines, and Kat was one of them kind of a struggle for both parties sam me it was a struggle to find the continuation of her Mm -hmm. so that was actually really hurtful instead of just continuing to be there for the sake of being there barbie decided to end her frustration and the fans frustration as well and just take cat out of the euphoria equation which allows the writers to have one less character to deal with i think it was a mutual decision i think my character who i love so dearly i don't think there was a place for her to go that's a gutsy move so good on barbie i don't watch euphoria so i don't know how her character developed or actually how her character underdeveloped over over those two seasons walking away from a steady paycheck is never easy especially a paycheck that doesn't prevent you from making other paychecks because the reality is euphoria doesn't really take up that much time because the tv show used to be a huge commitment that you do 22 episodes a season you'd get like i guess four months off around then, and then you'd be back at it. But now, Euphoria, their last episode aired in February 2022. That's over a year ago. And the returning actors for season three don't even have scripts yet. (laughs) So it's gonna be at least a few months before they're back on set. So it's gonna be close to two years in between seasons. So yeah, the actors had enough time to go do other projects. So Barbie had enough time to go do more fulfilling projects and then just go back and get her paycheck for season three. I'm not saying she should have done that, but she easily could have done that. And it says a lot about her that she's putting her self-worth and her desire to challenge herself above money. That's amazing. But what do you think of Barbie's decision to leave Euphoria because her character wasn't getting the attention that Kat deserved? 